Hey, YouTube world. Hey, Kurt Patrick. Thanks for dropping in. Uh, I thought I'd do a little dilly and then uh, I'll tell y'all an interesting kind of story here tonight. But anyway, let's do a little dilly first. <laughs> y'all know I'm fixing to leave on a trip uh, going to Oklahoma to Oki Homestead Expo. Yeah. I'm booked all four days, you know. Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> Pay to play? Nah. It's really not. It's just uh, helping other people out. Yeah. Anyhow, I remember Way back yonder, uh, now, uh, just to give y'all a little bit of background for those who don't know, my, my daddy was a baker. He moved to this town in 1956. I was one year old. Opened the first bakery and was very, very successful. Very successful. People don't realize how much a bakery can bring in in money. Anyhow, he's smart and he's safe. But uh, every year, first two weeks of August, he'd close the business. Just close it down. And this is back when you couldn't buy it. grocery stores didn't have bread. You had to go to the bakery to get bread. Yeah. But it was a big thing. He loaded us all up in the station wagon, him and mama, four boys. And we'd go. Oops, sorry. We go out somewhere in, in this here U, United States, you know, and explore a little bit. And every year we got to pick out where we was going. And my oldest brother, he's eight years older than me. Daytona Beach. So we go to Daytona Beach. And my second oldest brother, he's four years older than me. Daytona Beach. Man, I never saw nothing Daytona Beach give me the time of day, so. I mean, they had a look down there, but I didn't. I did see fish fall out of the sky one day, though. In Daytona Beach, yeah. Big storm, whirlwind, whoop a wheel, cyclone, what do you call them things coming across water, water spout? And it come across water and phew, dump bait fish all over the parking lot of the hotel. <laughs> yeah, it did. But anyway, <clears throat> getting back to the, the story part here. Uh, so every year, they closed the bakery, and you know, when it came my turn to pick. I didn't want to go to Maine. I didn't want to go to Maine, spend a night two in the cabin on a lake and fish. Daddy made it happen. I showed him a thing in the back of the comic book. Or a filling stream book. Right there, Mama. He called him up. Booked it. He done it. Yeah. But I was remembering his traveling. And a lot of people will be traveling this weekend. And uh, I remember how we used to travel. Boy, uh, they the only ice chest they had back then was them uh, steel-looking... Coleman ice chip. About all you can get. <clears throat> and uh, we go to the ice house. And the ice house, you can get the ice in the box. Or they put it through the crush and crush it for you. Or you just get it in the box. You throw one block in the cooler and put all the food on the other side. Anyway, we, we would stop. You know, we were traveling to Yellowstone Park, okay? We be driving, 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 get somewhere in Arkansas, pull off the side of the road. 
mamma og popped up in the ice chest, got out there and made us a chicken salad sandwich fresh. Yeah, give us some Kool-Aid. <clears throat> Keeps us hydrated, you know. Spud, you getting it tonight, boy? Yeah. <laughs> He's, yeah, he dreamed he was on that trip. It was a trip. Anyway, get out to Kansas. Drive miles and miles. It's flat as a pancake corn on either side of it. Just going through a wall of corn, Kansas, Nebraska. Y'all don't mind. Anyhow, that's that's how they did back then. There wasn't no holiday in. Uh, there sure wasn't no cell phones or thing like that. You, you, you got your old Ram McNally Atlas. And you had to go down to the local uh, hardware store to buy. You took it home. You studied it out. This bit, I can do this, we can do this. And uh, just hope there's a gas station. But I remember we was... Damn near about to run out of gas going through Nebraska. There ain't crap from uh, Lincoln all the way to North Platte. There ain't nothing there. And we should have filled in North Platte, but it was high. I mean, not North Platte, Lincoln. But it was high. We was heading west now. Yes, I ain't paying that. So we rolled on, you know. Man, we got to North Platte. We was glad to pay. It was cheaper, though. We was, we, we'd pay anything. We'd buy it out of gas. It was. Ain't that right, Stuart? That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Anyhow, uh, keep us entertained for all them long trips. For all y'all subscribers, you got children. Oh. Uh, Mama would give us a, a little map, piece of paper with it, a printed out map. Oh, yeah. Uh, 48 United States states. Didn't have Alaska and Hawaii. And uh, what we do is she'd give us all that and then our pen, you know. We colored on the back of the thing and we wouldn't do anything. But anytime we, we saw a state, we put a check mark on that little piece of paper there, you know. Saw a Georgia check, check, saw a Florida check, check, saw a Alabama, Mississippi check, Tennessee check, 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 check. Well, in either a trip, <clears throat> whoever had the most states won. I don't know what we won, but it was a lot of fun, anyhow. It was. And then, and then another thing uh, they did was uh, who could spot a green car? And so we played that. There's a good, that's a good, that's a good, that's a good, green car. They seem like come in bunches. Hmm. You don't want to play it. There's a white car, there's a black car. Just, nah, I mean, you ain't got time for that. Anyhow, I'm just, just thinking back on all the little things they did, because, you know, we, we was riding thousands, thousands of miles. And, uh, crazy. Wasn't no holiday in, wasn't no motel. You just pull over, take a nap, get up, get it on again. Out of, out of, out of mama's ice chest. Yep. Anyway, all y'all's out there traveling, uh, be safe. Uh, you know, go in hot, know you're surrounded. Yeah. It's a crazy world out there. It is. I don't know why. Yeah, I think I do.
Victor Fetchy. Thanks for stopping by. Shh. Best kept secret on YouTube, I'm telling you. Anyhow. God bless. Adios.